To balance this equation, BCl3 plus H2O, that's boron trichloride plus water, will count the atoms up on each side of the equation. We have one boron atom, three chlorines, two hydrogens, and one oxygen. On the product side, we have the one boron, we have a chlorine over here, we have three hydrogens, but do be careful, there's a hydrogen here as well, so you have to count all of those. Four, and then three oxygen atoms. So when we look at this, why don't we take and multiply the hydrochloric acid, the HCl, by three. This three applies to everything, so one chlorine times the three. That'll give us three of those. Those are balanced. We do now need to update these hydrogens here, though. So we have the three here, plus now we have one times three, three there, so we have six. We could fix the hydrogens now. That might even fix the oxygens because we need to have six over here. So if we put a three, two times three, that'll give us six of those. So that's helpful. And then one oxygen times three gives us three of those. We're done. This equation, it's balanced. I would say the thing to watch out for here, often people count these three hydrogens and they forget about this one. Then it makes it very difficult to balance. I also like leaving oxygens till last when I do my balancing. That seems to help. This is Dr. B with the balanced equation for BCL3 plus H2O, boron trichloride plus water. Thanks for watching.